Hey everyone, I'm Mark Burley. And I'm Alan Siegler. Alan Siegler, please tell me a little bit about Home Health Aid. So Mark, Home Health Aid is one of our events where students actually get to practice some, I think, very practical skills to a career that you may take on while you're in school working towards uh, your ultimate career goal right. uh, as a Home Health, health Aid. And, and those are very important careers uh, because there's such a huge need for that. But this event is two rounds. Uh, round one is a... It's a written test. So you take 50 questions, multiple choice. If you do well enough on that particular test, you then make it on to the next round. Next round is all about? Skills. Right. And it's very important that you read the guidelines because each year these could change. But some of the skills that you'll be asked to do may include taking an apical pulse, uh, giving a back rub, draining a urinary drainage unit. Uh, so the list, you know, could vary and what's great about our events is that uh, they really prepare students to be successful and to master those skills because this competitive event could have seven skills but when you get to the room that day you may be only asked to do three of those seven skills so you get to practice all of them to go in and only be asked to do maybe one two or three of those skills or right. more right and as well as being good at the skills you have to have the knowledge behind it and that's why the test and the skills are both added together at the end to determine who was the best in that particular event uh, however, make sure you do well enough on your skills portion. Yes, there is a 70% rule, which means that if you don't get at least 70% on your skills right. uh, combined, then uh, you will not be advanced or recognized as a event finalist. So read the guidelines, prepare, and uh, you'll do great. Good That's luck to you. Yep, thanks guys.